the two most important days in your life are number one, the day you're born. Number two, the day you find out why. There was a time and age where if somebody had mental health issues, let's just say they were acting out or acting unresourcefully, they would be referred to as crazy, potentially imprisoned in some way, shape or form, and almost penalized for being ill. Neuroscientists have nailed the ability to be able to uh, monitor and locate where certain activity happens within your brain when you think of certain things or you feel certain emotions and, and smell and, and so on. You can tell which parts of the brain that's happening in, but you still can't explain the mind. The mind is a lot bigger than that. My life completely crashed in 2003. I had one of the biggest breakdowns in my whole life. I've been at the bottom of the barrel, full of rage and frustration. What happens is when you go through something traumatizing, you get angry. And one of the things that you do is you develop strategies in your mind, right? And then momentary thoughts, all of a sudden you decide, hey, that, that fucking sounds good. Let's go with this. One of the common things people do is self-sabotage. Enjoy the process of cultivating and enjoy the wonderful people you meet on this journey. Now, people that will inspire, educate and empower you so that, you know, you can give that light back onto others, right? And more importantly, for future generations to come so that we can create a generation of children that are going to grow up to become leaders and custodians for our planet and our fellow human beings once we are long gone. We can only do our bit. I hope that this is going to set off that ripple in the ocean. So 